Well, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everyone. Um, I'm having a real issue right now. Where um, uh, actually, let me let me just start and get to the straight. Um, my sleep has been uh, so uh, bad right now. Sometimes I don't, I don't sleep forty eight hours, and um, for the past half year, I have been even sleeping with a sleeping in a day and the way at night. And how this happened is I started messing my sleep up until eventually my whole circadian rhythm and um, sleep has been so messed up that I, I'm only awake in the, in the night when the moon and the stars and never awake when the, when the sun and the light is in the day. So um, this has been going on for like the past half a year, maybe seven, eight, nine months now. And it's really been destroying my immunity, my life and my health. And I just want to show you... Uh, some of the symptoms, if you don't sleep, um, if you can drink, you can eat, but if you don't ever sleep, if you can't switch off your, your brain uh, like that and um, really uh, live normally, which right now I'm, my, my stress is high because of the, of the night, just being awake in the night all the time and um, sleeping during the day and it's really, it's really uh, killing me right now. Um, so, uh, yeah, for 30 days, let's see what, uh, uh, delayed, I, hold on, I have some, uh, oh yeah, here it is, it's called, it's called, uh, hypersomnia, and, um, yeah, I never thought I would have something like this, I mean, I have insomnia since childhood, I can never sleep, I can never turn off and, uh, sleep normally, but right now I can't even sleep in the in the night I sleep in the freaking day and it's really killing me this is a emergency guys really serious video um, so let's read uh, hypersomnia is a neurological uh, disorder of excessive time spent uh, sleeping or excessive sleepiness so oh god uh, it can have many possible causes I haven't even read this guys and can cause distress and problems with function that's exactly me I can't function right now and it's killing me so much, it's doing so much harm and destroying my health. Uh, I'm fine otherwise, but this sleeping is really killing me. I don't get how I have so much energy in in uh, the night and I'm so tired in the day, but it's really killing me like this. It's uh, With the seven, eight, nine months, I'm literally starting to die, guys. I'm literally starting to die right now. And it's, uh, I can, uh, if you don't get sunlight and the vitamins from the sun, in the day, then you're really killing yourself. If you just live in the night, in the night, I literally am like a freaking vampire right now. <laughs> just uh, I don't even know how I'm smiling right now. I'm literally dying uh, with this. If if this would be for like five years, I'll be dead by then. Honestly, this needs to fix. I need some sleep doctor or something. But anyway, let's let's read. In the fifth edition of the uh, di diagnostic and statistic blah, 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 money of mental disorders. Well, this is a mental disorder, unfortunately. Hypersome knowledge of which there are several subtypes appears under sleep wake disorders. Even my family knows about this, but they never really knew how to help me or what to do. And uh, uh, I mean, I don't, but uh, I need to get some sleep doctor and uh, really check my health because I haven't been to the doctor. <coughs> the whole time I've been coughing, you can see. Even my physical health is not great because of this. Um, yeah, um, hypersomnia is a pathological state. What the hell, really? A st state characterized by a lack of alertness during the waking episodes of the day. It is not to be confused with fatigue because I never really get tired. They know me like this, which is a normal phys physiological state. Daytime sleepiness appears for... Uh, sleepiness appears most commonly during situations where little interaction is needed. That's true. I don't really do much in the day either. Of course, I'm. I really don't know what the hell ha my life has become, guys. This is for the past like six months or more. Uh, since the patient's attention levels are impaired, their quality of life may be impacted as well. This is especially true for people whose uh, jobs request high levels of attention. <coughs> 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 for example, in the healthcare field, uh, indeed, a lack of attention can cause injuries to self or others. 
well, I really only harm myself, I don't really harm others, I don't have the need to harm others, I've never harmed anyone, would never hurt anyone, and, and I never did. So that, that, that one is not true, I'm a nice guy, I just hurt myself, okay? I wouldn't go around and hurting so, uh, someone, maybe something, sometimes I smashed uh, some device, electronic, yesterday I broke my phone because I was pissed off, but let's not talk about that. Which makes this disorder a real public health issue as well. Yeah, my issue is really serious and uh, it probably needs to be talked about publicly because uh, I really am feeling fucked up right now, guys, and this is really killing me. Uh, what else? Symptoms. So, let's see. Holy shit, the symptoms are going to be bad. Uh, the main symptom of uh, hypersomnia is excessive daytime sleepiness, EDS, in brackets, or prolonged nighttime uh, sleep which has occurred for at least three months. Again, I have been having it for like six, seven, eight months. Uh, uh, three months prior to diagnosis. Uh, sleep drunkenness. What the hell? I don't drink. Sleep drunkenness. Oh, that, they mean it in a different way. Sleep drunkenness is also a symptom found in the hypersomniac patients. It is a difficulty to uh, transition to transition from wake to sleep. So you, yeah, because sometimes I literally sleep in the day, even if I don't uh, sleep. I daydream all the time and I, and I sleep literally during st even standing or sitting on a chair. I'm literally fucked up right now, guys. Um, yeah, uh, it appears uh, in non hypersomniac persons, for example, after a two night, two short night of sleep, fatigue, and consumption of alcohol. Well, I don't drink alcohol, I, could, I, don't, I don't do drugs or smoke or drink alcohol, but uh. Or hypnotic skin, what the hell, I don't do that, can cause sleep drunkenness as well. Also, that's from, basically I have the symptoms of like a drunk, drug user, but I don't do drugs or I never had an alcohol, I was never high in my life. Why do I have to have these symptoms where I fucked up my sleep so much that I'm literally having the effects of some drunk, druggy guy? Why me? Why me all, of all people? He's fixed his life and... Um, I'm more positive than ever, but this thing, this single thing, this sleep has ruined so much of my life and it's really destroying me so much. I don't know why I have these symptoms. I don't know why I have this <coughs> because I don't sleep. That's why this sleep, not sleeping and not sleeping for 48 hours and um, like, I don't know, like just not sleeping has really fucked me up. I don't, I don't know. Why I'm the one have, having these issues, but uh, you can see this is a really fucked up. This is a massive health, health emergency for me. I didn't think I would ever do this anymore, and it starts to affect my mental health and um, really fucked me up so much. So uh, I'm sorry for swearing, but this has literally been tearing my life apart. And I never knew what the, what this was, and I until yesterday, uh, I never knew that this it would be this serious. So please, guys, think of me. I really need family and friends right now to get through this. I really need some sleep doctor because this is so screwed up, honestly. This, uh, just living a night can really make your life hell. And I'm literally living like that now. So, um, like a freaking vampire or something, okay? Since I, s because of the sleep. So, uh, I don't even know how I'm smiling sometimes. I'm so I'm such a strong guy. But this is really, really fucking me up, guys. I really need your help. Please help me. I need support over anything right now. I really need family and friends to help me right now. I can't be alone in this, okay? So please help me. Uh, yeah, just help me, guys. I really need any any help I can get right now. Um, yeah, my circadian rhythm. Let's let's just do one. Circadian rhythm sleep is really yeah you can see how much stuff it fucks up i am really oh god the, it, you know it affects the vision it affects the the five senses how am i not dead right now i should be dead i'm like a freaking terminator right now how <coughs> how can my body after seven months still be alive and uh, function i really don't get how i'm what the hell is happening with me Circadian rhythm has all these things, high testosterone, high alertness, bell movement, melatonin. You know, melatonin is a, is a, a, something like dopamine, something like serotonin, but I am losing that really quickly. With the sleep, it's doing more bad than good. 
oversleeping or uh, not sleeping for 24 hours, 48 hours. I'm really doing what I shouldn't be doing. And um, I know how this started to happen, but I'm gonna, I might get into that somewhere else. Basically, um, I started really oversleeping and then um, it did more harm because I was even more tired, even though I was sleeping too much. I started to get tired and my uh, uh, my cycle and uh, it started to get upside down and literally I'm up living upside down right now just uh, sleeping in the day and awake until the night and it's fucking me up so much um, best coordination fastest reaction time I don't have any of those things okay uh, you can see here the day uh, yeah and then to my tomb in the morning get this I, I okay let me tell you when I get awake okay I get in, awake into half three uh, sometimes four, okay, five, maybe not too much, but I get away really late in the day. At the second, I get awake at the second half of the day, okay, and I'm awake until the morning. Sometimes I don't sleep for forty hours from then, and it's fucking me up like, like this, okay. It's screwing my health. I really need some doctor to see. I really need some help. I need some mental help. I need some sleep doctors. I am fucked up like, like this right now. I am this fucked up right now, okay? This is all, guys. This has been an uh, insane health emergency, and I really, really need family, friends. I need a doctor. I need to go to the hospital right now, okay? I am not healthy. I need to. I need them to fix my brain right now because my brain is like this right now, okay? And I am really screwed up. I really need some help uh, immediately, as soon as possible. I really need uh, the correct doctor, I might need to take some serotonin, dopamine, some happiness hormone stuff uh, to fix my health. But most importantly, uh, beyond that, I need to fix my health, uh, sleep. I need to fix my food. I need to uh, fix my uh, drink. I mean, I, I do drink a lot. That's the one thing I do. I do drink water. I do drink uh, orange juice. And I don't even eat that bad but the what I, I even eat like things I'm supposed to eat in the morning in the night in the day in the night in the night uh, just things from the night really and it really has been screwing me up like a million uh, million miles in like every single day okay so uh, I hope I'm gonna be alive in like the next six months if I do get help uh, then I'm gonna definitely fix myself. There is ways even for things like this to fix. There's always a way. I just need a sleep doctor. That's all I need. If, you, if anyone sees this, please help me. I need any single help. Any little small tip can help me. Any tricks. I really need to start going to sleep in like 10 in the night maximum. And today I've woken up in like 4. Okay. I woke up in the 4 in the afternoon and I started making this video. I already failed this video like 3 times. But this has been really good. Okay, thank you guys. Um, uh, don't live like me, okay? Don't just please sleep normally, or you will end up like me, okay? You don't want to live like this. I'm telling you, you don't want to be awake in the night and uh, sleeping in a day, okay? If you're stressed, if you get stressed all the time, this is what can happen. Your sleep can start to deteriorate. You don't sleep, and I freaking don't sleep, okay? If I sleep, it's a fucking miracle, okay? I'm telling you. Half of the half of my life I have not been sleeping, but I have never been so screwed up that I'm awake only in the night, okay, and sleeping in the day. That is fucked up, okay. Sorry I'm swearing, but I had to say this. I had to inform you about my health. You guys deserve to know how I'm doing, okay? I don't wanna freaking die. Thank you for watching this and uh, well for me I'm gonna have to go to sleep because it's been so fucked up in a way that uh, it might take like months to uh, fix all my life because sleeping is the only thing that's been giving me all these uh, mental health problems nothing else i'm saying otherwise i'm normal but this oh i'm starving guys uh, i really need to go eat i need to fix myself thank you for watching thank you for being here with me please i need your help okay uh, thank you and bye